Hello guys, I look a mess so I just came out from like a eight and a half hour shift and like <sighs> okay whatever this video isn't about me but it is about a journey so I have decided to move um yeah so this house was my first home in Canada and it has a lot of lot of special memories to be honest um but yeah I had to move because I just wanted an easier transportation method to my workplace and all and that is that is honestly uh, one of the reasons that I um, thought of moving in the first place because I hate packing up things and like finding a new home again <laughs> but I just feel like it has to be done it is necessary I think over the past um eight months seven months wow <laughs> over the past seven months I have really kind of found a comfort I found what I like I've grown as a person I think this house has seen a lot of uh, I think a lot of um I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I'm getting emotional. I don't even like this house that much. But yeah, I feel like it's kind of like the uh, part that it has played in the journey. Um, taking this house was actually quite like a very quick, quick decision because um, if you remember from my video, one of my videos, I've mentioned that I got my visa and everything approved in a very short span of time. So I had to find an accommodation really quick. And this is something that I came up and I was like, OK, fine. But again as usual many problems came up <laughs> but i learned to cope up with a lot of them i made really good friends i made families here and i'm gonna miss this place so yeah driving away from the topic i'm gonna do a moving vlog today so i'm moving in about i want to say three days to maximum um I have to get up all the stuff and like pack it into my bag. I definitely have way, way more clothes than I came with. I feel like I have half of the value village in my room here. But yeah, I'm gonna make an effort to pack like most of my accessories and knickknacky things and all. And then my dresses. <sighs> yeah, so I'm gonna stay at like a temporary accommodation for the next month and then like move into my final place so i have to pack in a way that i'll be able to live out of the um live out of one luggage bag for like a month but that is something that i've done after coming here as well so i should be very okay with it but yeah that is practically what we are doing in today's video let's do this so this is a little family wall that I built in my home. It has like really good memories of um, moments and people that I always want to remember. And removing this is, it is quite sad. And I really hope I don't tear the wall. There we go. Very good. Yeah. So I'm in a situation where I don't know how to do this. So I have two of my luggages right here. There's no way in the world that everything is gonna fit in here, for sure. And if that wasn't enough, I bought this. This huge, huge toy. Why? Oh my god. I'm gonna make it work. I don't know how, but I am. So this is one of my luggages. This is a full size one. That's a mini one. And I have one more uh, in the side where I've kept my things um i'm pretty sure this has actually things inside it yeah it has some it has some essentials that i haven't used yet <laughs> if you want a quick insight of what i bought from india when i came here i bought horlicks I bought shampoo, which I still have. So imagine this is like after a period of like eight months, I still have like a stock of shampoo. I have some tissues, I have pens for life. I have some deodorants. I have some plastic covers, which is 
Okay, fine. Hardly enough, though. And I've got a whole bunch of sheet masks. I don't know what I was thinking because I haven't gotten time for it. And I honestly don't remember what is in this bag. So I have my documents and the sari is given by like a very special person to me. And yeah, that is basically all the things in here. I'm going to try and sort this out and then arrange it. It's going to be a fun night, guys. It is going to be a fun night. And excuse the fact that I look like a freaking ghost and I have a pimple coming right here. Which always comes when I get stressed and I'm very, very stressed at the moment. The time is 11.37 right now and I am going to try to pack. I'll see you. So that is all my kind of accessories and nicky nicky things and my bed sheets right there. These are like half of my clothes pile. What it looks like. I'm really sorry for the situation. I just removed all the photos from my room. I've emptied out one of the cupboards and I'm doing the other. And that's all that I need to fit in here and there. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> but I feel like something good that I did is since it's the summer, I have all my winter clothes in one um in one luggage bag. So I don't need to worry a lot about that, but I think it's worth investing in when the feeling is mutual. Oh my god, it's a bad lighting here. I'm really sorry about that, but I don't have enough energy to wake up and go and film this somewhere else. So we're gonna deal with it. So I'm gonna do a tiny little Timu haul right now. Temu? Timu? Timu? Yeah. Um... I just could not I just could not resist so for the longest time I just did not open the demo app but once you open it you get in like you get like pulled in to all these things and I had to give in okay so that's my little package that I received and in here there are a lot and lot of products and let's just see this is the first product that I got. So I wanted a laundry basket and I anticipated for something a little bit bigger than this. But that's, that's, that's practically all. It's a tiny little laundry basket, but it's fine. Um, I'm sure I have a use for it anyways. So I have already opened some of these packages. I was just way too excited, guys. You should know this about me. Um, but yeah let's just go through it because i was very excited and wanted to show someone so i bought a lot of accessories because i mean i love the accessories phase so let's start off with this okay so this is basically a little fairy light that i bought i'm not sure if it works actually i should really try it out i haven't opened this or connected it Yeah. The second thing is I got these packet of stickers and these were for like dirt cheap like I would say like a dollar or two and they got like pretty cute stickers in here and this was all friends theme so they got a couple of stickers. <sighs> Why I need stickers right now? I'm not sure. I make bad choices but I did stick it in kind of like the back of my laptop and it looks pretty cute. <laughs> or the little microphone now this was a bad bad choice because i don't feel like it works um i connected to my phone and tried it out once but it didn't work so i gave this for a return um i had this um acne patches so there is supposed to be like 114 of them i i don't know so in demo, one of these things is um, you have to kind of reach the threshold of 20 bucks in order to purchase products, right? And um, it was late into the night and I was like, okay, might as well add this to just reach the threshold. And that's really the reason of buying this. Again, this is again a product that I returned. And uh, yeah. Okay. The next product that I got is... So, it's these little things. So, they go, like, on your camera. It's not focusing, of course. It doesn't want to focus. So, it goes on your camera. And 
I've been so, so bad with my phone. I've been rocking, dropping it everywhere. So I don't want to risk it. So it comes with a, a pack of, it comes with a pack of two and some cleaning wipes as well. So I'm going to stick this on and I'll tell you how it goes. What else? I bought was this really cute heart necklace. Wait, I'll open and show this to you. As if I don't have enough necklaces, the next thing I'm definitely buying is a jewelry organizer because I do not have space to keep all this in. That's a very cute little one. It's a cute little heart. I like this. I like it. This thing I bought was, again, it, it is another necklace. Um, and this is something that you could personalize. You can have engravings of your own. And I've just put down a very special date in here. But yeah. I'll let you know all these accessories were like less than a dollar so yeah that's what it looks like it's a gold ring with an initial on it so yeah okay next again continuing with the themes of accessories i bought these like clip-on earrings so they're supposed to give the effect of fake piercings i don't know i thought so <laughs> initially when this came and i had no idea what to make by it because they kind of look like earrings they kind of look like rings i don't know so they basically go on top of your ear it looks badass i feel like it looks badass i like it i have another necklace this is kind of like so this is kind of again like a like a thin plain one and that's how it looks like and some hair clips because I've been wanting this. All the ones that I bought from back home went missing. Like it happens with hair bands. It's just gone. It just disappeared. And the last and final thing that I have is this really cool glass. Now, I'm not really a glass person. I don't feel like it suits my face really, very well. But this was like dirt cheap. It was like a dollar or two. And I just wanted to see... Um, that's basically how it looks. I don't, <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about it. I did give it for a return because I don't feel like this shape particularly adds any beauty to my face or yeah, I don't know. This is a no-no from me, but yeah. So that is all the things that I bought from Timo and what I can tell you is always, always make sure to read the comments of the products before buying it because like this sometimes it'll be half the size that it's meant to be um this was much more focused on kind of accessories and all that stuff but i am as i mentioned moving really soon and i want to get some house decor things so yeah so there will be more demo hauls yeah <laughs> so yeah back to the video bye Feels good, it fits right. We don't move too quick. Got hers, I get mine. We say, ooh, that's it. Say what I feel is a fact. She said she feel it right back. Got sentimental, locked the momentum. Said what I meant though. Yeah, I got what I give. Can't block what it is, and I'm not on the triple flake. If the clock got thick and we got off script, I won't just dip. I stay. Let the incense float out and defenses go down. If the pot get big, if I lost my chips, I'll process it and say it's up. Okay. So I'm home and this is practically the end of the video. I don't know what else to do. As I mentioned earlier, this is only a temporary accommodation. So I don't really want to show you around the house or anything. But until next morning, I'll see you again. <laughs> if you haven't already, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And always, I'm happy to hear your suggestions. And let me know what you'd like to see next. That's it.